Hello everyone. So I just want to take a second to introduce you to my kitty. She was in my last video too. That's like her favorite spot to nap. Katniss. <laughs> Say hi. Katniss, look. Say hi. Oh, I just love her. I just adore her. <laughs> I don't know if she feels the same about me. She kind of looks like she wants to. Uh, she looks like she's plotting my death right now. <laughs> so today's video is going to be on days of the week. Um, this is great if you want to do certain spell work on um, tapping into like the the associations. Um, or co correspondences with each day. Um, you can plan your spells if that's your thing. Um, not everybody does that, and that's fine. You know, like I, I've said in many videos, I think, at this point, but um, to each their own, and you can just do what feels right to you. Um, there are no rules when it comes to the craft, and that's one of the most beautiful things about it. But um, So I will go through each day of the week, and this is just a, a quick overview, and... Um, and that's the thing like i think that these these videos my goal in these videos is to um just to provide some information and if it sparks an interest hopefully it goes and, and it, and it um, pushes you to do your own research and your own reading because i think that the craft is such an individual path that um it's great to really get your own opinion get your own research really pulling together what works for you so um, that's why my videos, I try and I strive for them not to be too long and not to give too much of my own opinion, um, because I think that um, it's important that you, you form your own. So, and what works for you. So this is just a quick overview in days of the week and their associations and their correspondences. Um, so first we'll start with Sunday and the color association is yellow and the planet is the sun and associations are success, promotion, fame, wealth, and prosperity. So any of these things that you want to bring in, um, it could be you're looking for a new job, you're looking for um, a pay raise, you're looking for anything like that, you're looking for prosperity, and prosperity is more than money. Prosperity, there's prosperity found in all aspects of life, excuse me. So um, today would be a great day, not today, but so Sunday would be a great day, not today. Today is not Sunday. <laughs> um, Monday, color association is silver, white, or light blue. Planet association is the moon. Um, associations are illusion, glamour, sleep, dreams, fertility, insight, peace, beauty, and women's mysteries. The moon is associated with, with uh, women's mysteries as well. Sorry, my husband is just... I, you know, he finds a way to infiltrate my videos. I, I think he does it on purpose. He's like, I just want everybody to know that I'm here. So let me, you know, knock some stuff over. Let me, you know, cough, clear my throat loud enough for not only my wife and her viewers to hear, but for the entire state to hear as well. <laughs> that's, that's what I feel. That's what I think. <laughs> Um, Tuesday, the color association is red, orange, and black. Um, the planet is Mars, and associations are war, conflict, courage, victory, rebellion, success, protection, and strength. Mars is uh, the god of war, and so it would be fitting for him to um, have associations with war and conflict. Now, this does not mean you want to bring in war and conflict, but this would be a great time to work with war and conflict if it is already happening. So um, if you want to ease tensions, if you want to bring peace to war and conflict or bring an end to it, it would be a beneficial day on Tuesday to do that. Wednesday, color associations are purple and orange, which always remind me of Halloween, which I love. And we are approaching on. It's not that many uh, days until Halloween, and I am so excited. Um, planet is Mercury, and associations are business, communication, debt, the arts, transportation, fortune, chance, and creativity. 
So for instance, let's say if you have some bills that are behind, especially in this time, you know, there are a lot of people that are out of work right now, unfortunately. Um, now would be a great time to associate the debt that you have, pair it with a money spell, and you know, you could you could create a, you know, forgive the debt spell or, you know, pay my rent spell. You can create anything and do it on a Wednesday and focus your intent on paying off that bill um, or all bills or whatever, you know, um, doing one spell for each bill. You could even do that. Um, so this would be a great day for that. Um, Thursday, the colors are royal blue, green and purple. Um, I do have my bullet point papers, which I have, um, I think, in all videos. Just keeps me on track. Planet is Jupiter. Associations are honor, loyalty, harvest, prosperity, abundance, wealth, and healing. Um, with the color purple, purple is associated with healing anyway. So, I mean, you could take those colors and... and like I've said before a million times, I'm going to say it again. I'm pretty sure I said it in the beginning of this video, but I'm still going to say it again. Do whatever works for you. You do not have to go by, um, as far as color magic, if, you know, it says to use a purple candle, you can use a neon orange one. It don't matter. Whatever feels right to you. Some people like to go with, with the properties that certain things have, which is, is how I do my magic. I do work with herbs and their properties, crystals and their properties. I try to plan, you know, for days of the week and moon phases to, you know, really line up my my spell work from, in my own opinion, for um, the least percentage of failure possible. So, um, or or the highest percentage percentage of success possible. Um, Friday, the colors are pink and aqua. Planet is Venus. Friday is the day of Venus. It is the day of love. Um, associations, love, birth, romance, fertility, passion, friendship, and pregnancy. Um, I'll just give you a little bit of what I do. Just just a little. And usually I don't, I don't try, I try not to put too much of what I do in here, but um, on Fridays, I do what I call and a, a deity honor ritual. And I do this, sometimes I do it once a month, sometimes I do it twice a month, but it's always on a Friday. And it's where I express my love, appreciation and gratitude towards my deities. And I do it on Friday because it's the day of love. And I want to show my love for the connection that I have with my deities and my path. So if you were to uh, write your own uh, deity honor, ritual or deity appreciation ritual, whatever you want to call it, Friday would be the perfect day because it's the day of love. Um, Saturday colors are black and dark purple. Planet is Saturn and associations are banishing, protection, wisdom, cleansing, and spirituality. So if you wanted to do any work with those things, Saturday could be, uh, would be the perfect day. Saturday is also considered a day of, considered a day of rest and reflection. So you could also do those things on a Saturday as well. So I hope this video was useful and helpful, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!